What's up guys, my name is Doug. Welcome to the channel if you are new. Welcome back if you are not new. I have just woken up, but we are already getting at it. Securing the bag, grinding, hustling, you know what it is. Got my coffee with me. As you all know, I'm in the business of being a thug. Today, we are gonna be listening to Field Negro by Royce the 5'9". Now, before we get into Royce, man, um, pause. <laughs> Royce the 5'9 has gotta be one of the rappers today with one of the illest flows in the game. I think that his ability to adapt to different types of beats and to different uh, sounds and his ability to create these, these awesome lyrics uh, in such awesome pockets in the tracks is just unparalleled. I mean, I think that... You know, Book of Ryan is just such an awesome, awesome album with amazing storytelling and awesome execution in his lyricism and in his wordplay. So, a lot of you guys have asked me to listen to this. And uh, as you all know, if you've been watching my channel for a while, lyrics are not my forte. I'm a lot better dissecting the production, so I will have the genius lyrics pulled up right here. And uh, I apologize if I don't catch everything, but it is my first listen. I know he's an extremely lyrical rapper, so I'm going to do my best to catch as much as I can. But uh, a lot of you guys said that there is just a lot going on in this track, and I'm very excited to be listening to it today. So uh, we're just going to get right into it. My social media has probably popped up on screen by now. I'd appreciate it if you'd follow that. Uh, the Patreon link is in the description and also on the end screen of this video and in the top right hand corner. So if you'd like to support the channel on Patreon, that'd be really cool too. Um, more patrons means less ads on the videos, which means eventually we'll have an ad-free channel if you guys are willing to support the channel on Patreon. You know, I do do this full-time, so I'd really appreciate it if you did that, too. So, with all that being said, let's just get right into it. This is Field Negro by Royce to 5 9 Let's get it. You ain't been getting this money all your life. Oh, you forgot about the roaches and all the mice. Uh -huh. All of your kids is in charter school, but you starting to do dark. You know the shit is bound to come out eventually underneath all the lights. Uh -huh. Rob a man, kidnap him, take him for all his rights. The ghost of politically correct Negroes like you close them to keep your ice platform. They make you feel like they love you there. It's distractions that you won't say anything at all and risk of losing something. Yo, this beat is really awesome. I gotta say, and it's produced by Royce himself, so, so sick, man. The jazzy vibes and the drums are just is so awesome. Getting lots of uh, To Pimp a Butterfly vibes from this. The oven don't open on the stove in the kitchen to heat up the house, cause they didn't cut the heat off in your home, right? Mm. Okay. In the game, a phony. Fucking all the same thotties in the game since way back. And all the same thotties in the game, and giving the same top to the guys with the hits of the Tigers, Drake's and Callis. Shit, this is what happens when your favorite artists never get challenged. Man not willing to stand up for his own rights to lose the use of his right and left leg. They say I couldn't do it. Door slammed in my face, stayed at the door. I stayed knocking, stayed rocking. I did it my way without all the complaining. Like Kanye or Wale for the validation of all the bloggers and all the same gay ass awards. Letters, I'm not here for the crown of Tory Lane's cheddar. I'm here for respect in <laughs> a small part of your life all the way up. Oh, you forgot about the home that you grew up in. When you were starving with nothing. When it was stripes on all the canned good. Plus, <laughs> none of these artists can beat me. I'm proving it Christ on the Noah's Ark on the waters of Fiji. I'm probably oh. the type that started new species. Oh, he's insane, man. How you got a team and you ain't got loyalty. Children is dying. Women is crying. We under attack, fool. What a better time to be famous, black, and impactful. Hey. Exus. You play for the NFL. I wow. just want to ask you. If you don't kneel with cap, it's simple math. Can I run it past you? It make the riches. We don't rise. They just keep us high. Product of slave privilege. Cop Ferraris to race a nigga. I'll do any keep an honorable spirit. I got blue spots right now, man. To distribute. They took the scriptures away and replaced it after making their own racist revisions. To rig it. I'm pretty sure they make her. It's livid. They racist. They bigots. Oh, What's my God. I'd rather be a Atheist chasing my faith through a prism, assuming the information is real, to play for a racist with a racist agenda. Uh, okay, if some of us don't have time, some of us have time, some of us performing at halftime, some of us boycotting halftime, some of us standing up, some of us sitting down. Reparations that never get back to us. <laughs> to face your truth. Go ahead and try to trace your roots. Field Negro by Royce the 5'9. What a track, dude. Five minutes and 49 seconds of just facts and just amazing display of lyricism of of getting across a coherent message but in an awesomely written way like lyrically you know just the rhymes are perfectly placed but they all still make so much sense it doesn't sound like he's searching for just any word that rhymes he's able to say exactly what he means 
in a way that fits with the beat and he made the beat as well and there's a bunch of beat switches and they're all awesome and the beats are just all really cool but what he's saying here he's talking about unity among black people because and he puts it perfectly right here if some of us don't have time and some of us have time, if some of us perform in the halftime and some of us are boycotting halftime, if some of us are standing up and some of us are sitting down, reparations will never get back to us. There's black people everywhere who have beliefs, but they're not unified. Some of them perform halftime shows. Some of them decline going to the halftime shows. When in reality, they should all get together and have a united front. They should all say, these are our goals and our ideas and and these are our interests and we will do everything together in one uniform way to get to where we want to get to that's what he's saying here is that there's too many people who aren't willing to stand up for what they believe in for what they believe in for fear of losing everything they made it from having to keep the oven open to heat up the house to having riches and having Ferraris and having big houses and they don't want to lose that and so they're afraid of standing up for what they believe in and he is criticizing those people for not having the balls to say what they believe it's just such a powerful track too and the album like the album but the, the songs artwork and just the interludes like with with uh, with the people talking is it's such a good track dude and there's so much going on and it really tackles a lot of really important issues that we have today and I think that yeah this needs to be listened to and it's so powerful and uh I expected nothing less from Royce to 59 so yeah man thank you all so much for watching this video thank you all for being here thank you for recommending this song to me I have more videos to get to so I will see you guys very soon let me know what you guys think in the comments let me know what you guys thought about this track and uh until the next video peace